Hey guys, what's going on? Andrew here, FS Paranormal. Just walking around the uh, old block here in Cabaret Court and points in off of Bordeaux. Bordeaux's right at the end of that street, it goes like that. And this is just a little circle area. You come down here and then it just goes around and comes out to the other side. I can't remember how many times I ever walked down this road when I was younger, uh, back when I was in late middle school to all my high school years here in Point Siena. I've had a lot of memories and uh, put in the paranormal aside, it's like a big trip down memory lane for me right now. I used to have a friend named Michael who used to live right down this house over here. And, uh, I'll show you guys that in a second. This house right here used to be Michael's house, a friend of mine I used to go to uh, high school with. He used to live right there, guys. Uh, it was a different color at the time. I believe it was a, a tannish color, tan brown. But yeah, he used to live right there. He used to walk down this road every day. After school, he used to go over there and play video games with him. When he used to live there. Feels like so long ago. <laughs> Always love memories, guys. Looks like they're building a new house here on Cabaret Court. Dog barking in the distance. You guys can see. Looks like they're getting the foundation in. It's been a while since I've seen a new house being built on this street. I'm actually walking right now to a spot where I think I could cross the ditch here. As you guys can see, the ditch is full of water. And I'm going to see if there's a spot where I could jump the gap. And luckily, get lucky with that. And I might be lucky, actually. The spot I usually jump up is right there. Let's go ahead and see if we can do that, shall we? Hi right, guys, so I gotta jump this real quick. Let's see how fun this is gonna be, All right? Mucky, mucky, mucky water. As you can see. Ooh. I made it. That was a little nerve wracking. Now the trailing question to get up to where I used to take the buses right over here, you would go around. But that's not where we're going. That's where we're going to investigate today, guys. And I always had this weird feeling whenever I used to walk around here. Not even at nighttime, just during the daytime. I feel like someone watching me the whole time. We're going to use our spirit box back on these trails and see if we can pick up any communication with anyone. Let's do this, shall we guys? As I began to walk down this path, I noticed that it was very creepy. Just like I stated, anytime I would walk by the path, it just it gave me these weird vibes. And I was getting that while I was walking down. It was daytime and I still felt uncomfortable walking down this path. Especially seeing it the way it was coming up right now. And then, something caught my eye right here. Out of nowhere, I noticed a black object sitting in the middle of the uh, trail. That is a black hat right there, guys. Saw it? Saw it take off in the distance? I was wondering what that was actually in the grass. So I'm here on the trail area where I never would want to visit this location. I always got this bad feeling like something was here watching me. And uh, it's actually really creepy being here, even during the daytime, guys. I'm not going to lie. I'm looking down and you can't really see nothing. I see a cobweb in actually in front of me. Big, big cobweb. Actually, real, real big. So I'm going to try to duck under. I don't want to get caught with that thing. All right. Look at this, guys. Look at that.
Hello? Did you guys hear that? Hang on, hang on, hang on. I heard uh, a conversation coming from these bushes areas right here. muddy trail right here and uh, we're gonna make our way in this direction we're make our way in this direction we're make our way in this direction we're make our way in this direction I'm just exploring the, the trail haven't been on this trail before so uh, yeah I keep hearing noises everywhere it's just the bugs you know what I mean Is there anyone here with me right now? Can you say hello? Just forest everywhere. Once you get into this trail, it's just forest everywhere, guys. I mean, there's really nothing here. My name is Andrew Roy. Can you tell me your name, please? I'm here setting up my tripod. I swear I keep hearing a conversation. And it's not coming from where the houses were, you know what I mean? You guys hear that? I haven't even got my tripod all the way out. What was that? I don't know if you guys heard that. It sounded like a female. You guys see down the road? I don't know if you guys can see down it. This in my bag right now, guys. Let me get out my spirit box. I swear I keep hearing conversations around here, and it sounds like it's coming from the wooded area. I'm not hearing it anymore. If there's anyone here with me right now, my name is Andrew Roy. I have this object in my left hand. It's not on yet, but I'm about to turn it on right now. If there's anyone around me right now that can communicate through me, you can use my energy to speak in this object. Can you do that for me right now?
could you tell me your name in this object right here, please? As always with Florida and the blazing hot sun, my cell phone decides to shut off and not function right while I'm doing my spirit box session. It was right after this video clip you just saw, and this is a slow down session so I could add some audio to explain it. Um, I did start an audio session though with my spirit box, and so what you're going to see is a slideshow with the audio piece of that spirit box session. And if I find any words, as always, I'll add text to the video. Hey guys, I'm doing audio recording because my cell phone's camera mode won't work because it's too hot. If there's anyone with me right now, can you say hello? Is there a gentleman with me right now? Is there a female here that needs help? Is there a child here that could come through and say hello? If you have a story to tell, I'm here to listen. Can you tell me anything about yourself? If you're in need of help, can you say help me please? As I stated, guys, I'm doing audio here with my my spirit box because the camera cannot film because it's too hot on my phone. Did something happen to you? Did you say you got into a fight? Are you in pain? Do you need help moving on? What? Did someone try whistling to me? how long this video is going to last because my phone shut off before I did an audio session earlier. Let's try doing the spirit box guys, shall we? We're going to go in reverse this time. I usually don't do reverse, but let's try it.
Is there anyone here with me right now? Can you tell me your first name and the object in my okay. left hand? Can you say hello for me, please? Did you find something? That's what I thought I heard. What did you find? Do you need help? Is there a female here with me right now? Can you tell me your first name and the object in my left hand? Sound like a little a girl or a female? Are you in need of help? I thought I heard F you. I'm a nice person and I'm only here to communicate. Can you tell me your first name, please? I'm gonna, have to, I'm gonna have to be leaving soon. It might rain. Can you say something for me, please, before I leave? Yes? What could you tell me, please? It sounds like a young girl's with me right now. Can you tell me your first name? My name is Andrew Roy. It's nice to meet anyone. Is there anyone here in need of help? Listening. Well, if you need help, if you could come through to speak, maybe that could help you move on if you have something to say. Could you say something for me, please? I'm listening again. I keep hearing, I'm listening. Do you like it when I speak to you through the white noise? Yeah. Can you tell me my first name? Who here knows my first name? My name is Andrew. Can you tell me my first name? Walking right now, guys, through the trail. Can you see the TV over here?
there a child here who's lost their mommy or daddy? Do you need help? I thought I heard a child say mommy. You guys heard that? That was so clear. I heard that with my own ears. I heard someone ask for their mommy. Do you need help finding your mommy? Wow. That sounded powerful right there. Whatever came through there, man, that was that was powerful right there. Hello, hello, my name is Andrew, it's nice to meet you. God, I thought I heard God. I thought I heard someone say Christmas. You guys heard that? There's the road right there. Can you see the cars going by? I'm going to be shutting this off now, and I'm going to be leaving. Can you come through and say goodbye, please? It was nice meeting anyone here. My name is Andrew Roy, and in honor, I ask you stay here, please, okay? Or if you came through and spoke, please move on to the other side, okay? I heard Sheriff. It's really hot out here, guys. Can you say goodbye for me, please? I heard goodbye right there. Alright, goodbye, guys. One more look down the trail before we end up heading off to the road. If anyone came through, goodbye everyone. Thank you guys so much. It's hot, man. But that was one heck of an experience. I thought I heard a few great things come through the uh, spirit box there. And uh, yeah, guys, that was an amazing, amazing trip out there. Hang on. So I used to walk this sidewalk here. Every day when I had to go to work, when I used to live in Point Siena. If you guys can see, I'm going down this way right now. I thought I heard some amazing things come through the spirit box there. And I'm telling you guys, I, I know where the houses were. And I know there was no echoing effect in there. But I swear I heard like a conversation coming right in the woods next to the... It was either the left of me at the time when I was... I think it was the left. It sounded like uh, a gentleman was having a conversation with someone else. And... Uh, I gotta go over audio to see if I captured anything there, guys. I thought I heard something, man. That was so clear. But yeah, guys, this is the wooded area that I was talking about in Point Siena, which is in that direction over there. It's all in there. And uh, this is Andrew Roy, signing off with FS Paranormal. As always, if I find anything, I'm gonna link it in the video with text, and if I find any EVPs. As always, guys, take care. Above all else, be safe. Thank you for checking out this new video. And uh, I will see you next time on FS Paranormal.